boys and girls, welcome to Kids Sir. Our snacks today are going to be all Halloween. Our first one we're going to do is we're going to make a witch's broom. And what you're going to do, you're going to get a bag of pretzel sticks and you're going to turn them into a witch's broom. All right. We're going to cut the top off of your Ziploc bag, because that's how your pretzels will come. Your pretzels will come just like this. We'll cut it off. Hopefully my scissors are sharp enough to cut your... Well, maybe they are, maybe they're not. Let's see. May not be either. All right, then I'm gonna give you a little piece of ribbon. Cut that off. That will come in your kit. Now you've got a straw and we're going to adjust our pretzel sticks to where they stand up. So we can fix them like a broom. All right, let's get these pretzel sticks standing up. Shake them down like that. Gather around the top. Put your straw in. Because remember, it's a broom. Tie it around like that. And then tie your ribbon around it. down on the table to get it tied around it, okay? And there is your witch's bird. And after you get through flying around on it, then you can eat your pretzels. All right. Our next snack we're going to make is you'll get a black bowl, you'll get two googly eyes, and you will get four pipe cleaners. Cut each pipe cleaner in half. You can take your pipe cleaner and just fold it, cut it in half with your scissors, and slip it through the rim of your bowl right there and fix your legs. Mine been sitting for a while so they're not too good right now. But then you're going to get a bag of popcorn. I know all of you like popcorn and you can put have mom help you put it in the microwave. After you popped it in the microwave you can pour it in your bowl. can have you a spider snack. There you go. Right there. You see it? Of course, you know popcorn's good. Okay. Now, our last thing that we're going to make is a pumpkin. using pretzels. Okay, you will get your pretzels in another Ziploc bag and you will get your 
uh, mini pretzels is what that, these are. They're just little mini pretzels. And you will get several, and then you will get candy melts. I have about 12 candy melts. And you can put these in the microwave and melt them, and mom help you. We'll take it over to the microwave, and we'll try 15 seconds and see what that does. It depends on how hot your microwave gets. And then you will get an M&M, not M&M, excuse me, a chocolate chip that is green for Christine. Okay, let's see here. No, not enough yet. That's going to be 20 seconds. get her spoon over here. Okay, boys and girls, we have our candy melts melted. And what I would do, I put about half a teaspoon, have mom help you measure it, a milk in there when you go to melt them so they don't harden as quick. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put this pretzel in here and roll it around, put it on the plate. I'm gonna do another one. You'll get about five pretzels. And by putting some, putting a little bit of milk in there, it will let you be able to do more of them. Okay? Now, what we're gonna do, see, I, I have done two. We're gonna put our chip on here. Let's see on top and let it harden a little bit. If, you, if you're in a real hurry, you can stick these. There they are right there. I'll move the, these off. You can stick those in the refrigerator and they'll harden up real quick. But put you just a little bit of milk, about a full, half a teaspoon of milk in with your candy melts and melt them that way that way they can harden in the refrigerator and there's your pumpkins right there with your little stem on okay hope you have a great halloween and be safe